Hello, I'm Zaki Rashid, and welcome to this week's Matters of Opinion. Listening to the debate on what needs to be cut to reduce government spending has almost become laughable if it wasn't so sad. It's a real-life shell game going on with the American taxpayers' money. The White House proposed budget for fiscal year 2012 cuts in half the funding for low-income home energy assistance programs, reducing it by $2.5 billion. Now, roughly 8.3 people used that program last year. Its target population is the elderly and disabled. The money is also used to give assistance with heating bills for Americans who are unemployed and living in the coldest climates. The budget also proposes cutting college grants for an undertrained and unemployed workforce. They are also seriously looking at cutting all or most of the funding given to public broadcasting. The Diane Reem Show, Talk of the Nation, and World Have Your Say could be silenced. Our proposed budget for the coming year is estimated at $3.8 trillion, and the Department of State and other international programs get roughly $53.8 billion of that money. Now, with five branches of the military, the Pentagon, and some of the best military technology known to man, including smart weaponry and more bombs that it would take to blow up the entire planet to defend ourselves, why are we still giving foreign aid to other countries to be our friends? And fighting wars to defend other people's rights in foreign countries at the expense of sacrificing services to the people here in our own country? Why are we giving billions of dollars to other countries at a time when we are cutting assistance to families and programs in our own country is a question we all should be asking. If we have extra cash after we take care of our own people, then I can understand it. But until we have given our own citizens a hand up, I can't understand giving a handout to other countries. In my opinion, the same basic principle that we apply to our own personal budgets should be applied when our government plans to spend our tax dollars before even considering giving donations to anyone else. Take care of home first. Well, that's my opinion. What's yours? Email me at zrashid at villagetv.org or view this segment and leave your comment on YouTube if you enter Z.A. Rashid in the search box. And we are also now on Facebook as well. I'm Zaki Rashid with Matters of Opinion.